Hi guys, uh, this is just a quick one. Um, going through what you might want to put in your bag for your employment support allowance medical. Um, at the moment, a lot of people are having to wait a long time because of the crossover for, for people from incapacity benefit to employment support allowance. There's a lot more people going for medical and a lot of them are getting overbooked and there's a long wait for a lot of them. So you'll probably want to take something to do. Um, my Kindle. I love my Kindle. Um, this isn't just something to do, this is also evidence of a living aid um, that will help me to understand because I can't actually hold a book open without being in a lot of pain. Also something to do, I'm hoping to be able to do some of my studies while I'm in the waiting room if I'm well enough. A drink. You will need a drink. Um, I'm taking this, it's got plenty of sugar in it and it's got caffeine so it will hopefully help me to stay alert and awake and be able to concentrate. Photocopy of my repeat prescriptions of all my medications um, for evidence for them, which will save you taking all your medications, which is a big help for people who are on a lot of medication. An appointment letter for one of my medical, regular medical appointments, evidence. Do not forget your appointment letter, you won't get in without it. You'll also need photo ID like your passport or your driving licence, UK driving licence. And if you're likely to need to use the bathroom while you're there, hand gel. Well, what brand? Hand gel. Toilets aren't great, a lot of people use them, so you need to be able to have hand gel that you can wash your hands and use the hand gel, and then you know you're coming out without picking anything nasty. Uh, so that's basically it. Um, I'll go into more detail about the medical in another video uh, soon. Um, I hope this helps you. Bye.